Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Dragon Ball Nation. Now today I'm going to be giving you guys my episode 47 preview, predictions, breakdown, whatever you want to call it, for Dragon Ball Super. Now, we all know this is pretty much one of the most exciting episodes in the entire Dragon Ball franchise, actually. And this preview gave us a little snippet of what we can expect. We do know... From the episode summary, which I can read off right now, a little bit of what to expect, and then I'll go off of that. Episode 47's title, SOS from the Future, A Black New Enemy Appears. I've read this summary quite a few times now in different videos. With the threat of the androids resolved, a new menace threatens the world of the future, a man suddenly appears and goes on a rampage, driving humanity to the brink of extinction, future trunks resists but even the power of a Super Saiyan is no match for this man called Black. Future Bulma resolves to ask for help from Goku and Vegeta in the world of the past. After taking half a year to gather enough fuel for a one-way trip in this time machine, the formidable foe Black bars Bulma and trunks his way. So we get a little bit of information there. And we saw Trunks running around a lot in the episode preview. Now, there was the episode preview and there was also the snippet of footage we see at the end of the episode before the end credits, if you guys saw it. And we see Trunks running around hiding just as we would have, you know, we saw with the androids. Uh, I've heard people say maybe this black Goku or this character called Black is an android. I'm not really sure about that. I don't see how that's going to be the thing. Maybe, and it would be a cool throwback. Uh, maybe some people would say it's lazy. I would think it's kind of cool, but... From the way this... And I said this in my Who is Black Goku video, which I can link down below if you have not seen it. I think that this Black Goku character isn't even really Goku. He's just... Obviously, he's going to look like Goku. We've seen that from the images that have been released but I think that it's just a completely different entity altogether and just looks like Goku but doesn't act like him of course or you know have any biological connection in the summary they refer to him twice and in the episode title they just refer to him as black and that's the interesting thing I feel like here to be completely honest that they just you know, we are aware it's Black Goku, but I said this in my, uh, the video that I linked down below. I don't want to regurgitate too much of that. Um, but I think there's something else to that. What do I think is going to happen, though? I think they're going to show what the fuel source they're using is for the time machine. They're going to show them gathering it. They're going to then try to get to the past. But I think at the end of the episode, what's going to happen is Bulma and Trunks are going to be blocked off obviously like the summary says and not be able to get to the past until the next episode this is the trunks I, I said it before I'll say it again this is the trunks from the Android saga the one that we knew from the cell games this is the same trunks I know that there's some inconsistencies of my being there and you know some people are confused about that if I really ha feel like I have to, I can do a video on it. I don't feel like I should have to. I think that it should be clear that it's the, the one from the Cell Saga. There's no reason they would promote this Trunks as Future Trunks if it wasn't that Trunks from the Cell Saga. They don't call GT Trunks Future Trunks, you know. Uh, you know, they even say after the defeat of the androids in Cell, the world's supposed to be at peace. It's pretty clear that they're, they're giving it that one. But I can do a whole video on that if you really... If people think that's necessary, comment that down below. I think Black Goku will appear in the episode, but at the end of the episode when he's, you know, the black enemy is blocking Bulma and Trunks off from the time machine, that's when he's going to appear, I think, because it would be a nice cliffhanger. Uh, he'll appear then, and then it'll be like the episode ends, and then we'll get the preview for the next episode. I did hear a theory going around last night that people think Bulma actually might die, the future Bulma, and you know what? I'm not saying that there's nothing to elude that's, that's going to happen at all. Of course, maybe Bulma uh, sacrifices herself to get Trunks in the time machine. 
that could be it too. Um, it, I'm not saying it's going to happen, but if it did, that would definitely be some, not to mention a tense moment, but some real drama that, you know, we, we see in the series. Now, I think that in some way and somehow she'll get revived. There's no Dragon Balls and Trunks' this timeline. And I hope they explain why they never he never used the Nameki, you know, the, the ones from New Namek. Um, maybe they were gone for some reason. I don't know why. But I don't know, guys. Those are my thoughts and predictions. If you guys think I missed anything major, comment it down below. Because you know what? I may have missed something that uh, you guys may point out. Share your thoughts, opinions, and theories down below, and I'll catch you later.